Hello, boys and girls! Welcome back to another day in Minecraft here among our various tree farms. And today we will start with yet another one. It's a big one, so it will be multiple episodes. The design is by Ilmango, but I have thrown in a few twists of my own. And we will come to that in due time. So uh, uh, let's just start this one. This first part is now done. And we are here at the top of what we have, looking at a big great pool that has a bit of a different shape than the other farms. Because here, um, it needs to be a bit bigger and the way we are dealing with the 2x2 two two, two trees is also different than with the auto farms. So this basin is there to collect not only the saplings but also the logs. And in this water column we get back saplings. And over here we basically can select which saplings we want and here you also can see what tree types we can form and then back down here um, we have a bit of uh, redstone it's not too complicated here on this side we have the sorter uh, with the three saplings on this side and then the three log types here and down here we have the dispensing of the saplings um, we get the signal uh, through this wall down here that is detected there and there currently redstone is missing and we have to consider two things the signal from there basically will push blocks down there there and back there enabling the signal to come through and the signal comes from up there because we only want to dispense saplings if we are uh, in need of saplings so basically uh, once the green uh, the tree has grown and uh, harvested and we need some saplings to plant the next one so that's all for today um not sure if uh, in the next episode i will continue with this project or uh, squeeze in another farm but that will do for now and uh, join me next time for another day in Minecraft. Until then, goodbye.